Hi, I'm Randy with BBQ Guys. Today we're going to cover the main things you'll want to keep in mind when shopping for the best gas grill for you. Odds are, you're going to have this grill for a really long time, so it's important to give these things some thought. Let's get to it. One of the first things to consider is what grill size fits your cooking needs best. Take a moment to think about what you cook most and how many people you normally cook for. The larger the grill is, the easier knocking out big batches of food for the party will be, giving you more time to relax. In addition to being able to fit more food, larger grills also mean more cooking versatility. Wider grills provide more temperature zone cooking options. Most meals require cooking different items at various temperatures, so it's nice to have a grill with enough space to accommodate everything. For example, Cooking zones that vary in temperature allow you to sear a steak over direct heat on one side of the grill while cooking veggies at a lower heat on the other. More burners equal more control of your cooking environment, which is always great to have. Over the years, we found the most popular grill size customers go with is somewhere around the 32 inch mark. This size provides enough space for versatility and looks sharp above the width of most access doors if you choose to build in. When it comes to cooking style, some grills have dedicated infrared searing areas. This means you should think about how many conventional burners you want to have in addition to your searing zone. If smoking on a gas grill is important to you, it's ideal to have enough room to cook with indirect heat as well. Some gas grills even have dedicated low BTU smoker burners, giving you the perfect amount of heat to smolder wood chips in the smoker box. It's important to look for a gas grill with durable cooking grids. Quality grills will use stainless steel as their material. Even if a grill lists stainless as the material, it's still important to examine the thickness of the grids as well. This is an area of the grill that receives a lot of wear. So the thicker the grids, the longer they will last. Another advantage of thick grids will be better heat retention when it comes to getting a good sear and bold grill marks. In addition, some grids are built with tighter spacing than others. This is a great feature to keep in mind. The more surface contact to your food, the more caramelization. Tight grid spacing will also prevent smaller food items from falling between the grids onto the burners. Next up, consider the construction of the gas grill's flame tamers. Sometimes these are called flavorizing plates or bars. This is the component of the gas grill that sits between the burner and the cooking surface of the gas grill. They help protect the burner from direct drippings of grease and debris. Flame tamers provide a surface for drippings to vaporize off of. So the more coverage you have with the particular flame tamer design, the more smoky flavor you will generally get from your gas grill. More flame tamer coverage also means more heat gets diffused as it rises from the burner toward the cooking surface. Grills with full coverage flame tamers will generally provide a more evenly heated cooking surface. When it comes to material, the best flame tamers are either constructed of heavy gauge stainless steel or quality ceramic pieces. This area of the grill receives a lot of wear, so it's important to make a selection that resists corrosion. When looking at gas grills, burner construction and design is crucial to examine because this is the heart of the grill. This is also the most common part that people find themselves replacing. It's an area where it's important to keep in mind that all stainless steel construction is not created equal. Burners can vary immensely in thickness of construction. A great example of this would be comparing a tube style burner made out of thin stainless steel versus a thick cast stainless steel burner. When it comes to gas grill burners, the heavier the construction and the more durable the material, the happier you'll be with its lasting performance for many years to come. As far as high temperature range, a lot of people use the BTU rating to get an idea of how hot their grill will get. Keep in mind, high BTU ratings don't always mean a hotter or better grill. Look at the entire grill design, because things like well insulated hoods and thick construction can utilize the same amount of BTUs better than some higher BTU grills with a less efficient design. In addition to conventional burners, Many premium grills offer configurations with one or more infrared searing burners. This burner type is what most steakhouses use because of its quick preheat time and high direct heat capability. This burner style is a great option if you want the highest heat range possible. When comparing gas grills, also take a look at if the grill you are considering has a rear infrared burner. 
This gives you the option to cook rotisserie style in your backyard. This feature is very popular for people who entertain often because it looks awesome while your food cooks on the grill and the constant turning of the rotis makes for a stress-free cook. High quality grills have a fully welded grill body construction and double line commercial grade stainless hoods. Double line hoods not only provide more insulation for trapping heat inside your grill, they also prevent the heat of the grill from yellowing the exterior of the lid, keeping it looking its best. An added feature many people enjoy having on their gas grill is integrated lighting. Some grills come with interior lights, which make it a whole lot easier to see what you're grilling at night. A lot of grills even have control panel accent lights, helping illuminate the control knobs of the grill for nighttime use. An important option that's sometimes overlooked is whether or not the fuel type of your gas grill can be converted down the road. Maybe your current outdoor space is best suited for a freestanding propane gas grill right now, but you want to leave your options open for running natural gas and building in your grill eventually. Make sure the grill you select either ships with a conversion kit or has a fuel type conversion kit available for purchase later. If you're looking at freestanding gas grills, check to see if the grill can be removed from the cart should you want to build it in later. When comparing gas grills, always make sure to glance at the warranty it comes with. This will keep you from having to spend money on parts that shouldn't have broken in the first place. Look for brands with a burner warranty around 10 years or more, and brands with lifetime warranties. Some even come with labor for replacement. We've made comparing warranties from the top brands easy for you with our gas grill warranty comparison chart. When shopping gas grills, look for ones with a solid plan for backup ignition, should your primary ignition method fail. Look for flash tube backup ignition. This makes it easy to ignite your burners with a lighter from the cooking grid surface. It's always important to glance at the compatible accessories that are offered along with a gas grill. Some gas grill brands offer griddles, smoker boxes, pizza stones, and even charcoal fuel baskets designed to fit your grill perfectly. We're here to help you through the entire process of shopping for a gas grill. And we know you may not have a lot of time to compare them and learn all their features. To make things easier, we've taken the time to test and review our most popular gas grills. You can check them out from our gas grill review page.